Yeah, hey guys, I've just woken up from I think a six hour sleep on a Saturday afternoon. Lately full time work has been absolutely killing me so today I thought I would just take the entire day off hence why there's no video out on Saturday. However tomorrow we're going back out to Techno HQ to go to their cousin coffee in the morning. Um, I don't know whether it's me or just a couple of other mates going but I'm definitely going to head up. But anyway, first of all this car needs some stuff done. I need to fix the headlight. I also need to hardwire in my dash. I've got to clean it up a little bit for tomorrow morning so we're going to do that and then um yeah, I've been running around with like one headlight for the past week or so So I think it's about time to change it. I don't really want to rock up to the meet tomorrow with one blown headlight I don't even know which one it is. I am so tired And then I got to sort through all this stuff here to try and find my headlight Well, check out the fully stick turbo <laughs> I didn't even turn all my headlights on. God damn it. Attempt number two. Uh-huh you seem to have found the culprit fixing you. Luckily enough for this side, I think I might be able to wedge my hand down there. Probably should be able to. I think I might have to roll the car forward. No, I think we should be right. I think it's in here actually. Oh, no, no, no. This one here I would put in, I know it works, so I might just end up doing it anyway. But this isn't a Phillips Crystal Vision. This is just like a standard orange bulb, so. Can't find anything else, we'll use that one. The only other possible place it could possibly be is in here. We got indicator bulbs. Ooh. Oh no, that's burnt out. God damn it. Pretty sure this one's dead. I think this is the one I took out of my car. No, wait, this one could actually work. I actually believe this globe does work because when I bought my car, I actually purchased a brand new set of these, but one of them already had it in and one side was the yellowy color, so I thought I'd just buy a whole new set, and I put the new whole new set in. So I'm not quite sure whether this is the blown one or whether this is the one that I kept because it still worked. Anyway, it doesn't really matter. We're just gonna change it anyway. That right there is supposed to be what's holding in my light. So at the moment, this is what's holding the entire light in. Because that bracket's not in there, it's not doing anything. Yeah, it's just that. It's just this that's holding the light in. That's okay though, we'll work that out another, another day. Another day, another one. See, because of the lack of the outside coating and the lenses, <laughs> that's gonna drive me mental. At least they both work, so that's all right. I have to make sure I remember to put this in next time I take off the front bar. So this is also what I was talking about, those fog lights before. Um, I said they had like halo rings in them, so I'll see if any of them work. They always keep blowing on me, so they probably don't. Oh, we got one on. That's cool. Up. Uh, no. <laughs> I'm just a mixed match of colors at the moment, aren't I? So that is definitely a job for future Zach. I'm probably gonna order some LED. Oh, focus on me, please. So I'm gonna order some LED headlights. That way they just stop blowing all the time. They're gonna be nice and bright um, without hopefully affecting anyone. Um, and then I'm also gonna have to pull the front bar off and I'm gonna get to all the backing of those headlights, make sure that I can fix that bracket up. Also fix that angel eye and um, yeah, do the rest of it. I might just even end up replacing the fog lights back to, where were they? These were the ones that were originally on my car and they have Philips Crystal Vision in them, so they're nice and bright. Um, they're pretty much brand new because I took them off the car with less than 100,000 Ks on them. And I can actually use that bulb in there because I think that's a, I think it's a H11 and I think the ones in the front are H7 and H4. I might end up just putting these back in the front if I can't get the halo rings to work, but I guess I'll work it all out later. Look at how my headlights are aligned right now. I just figured this out. <laughs> that's another issue I have to fix right there, that whole issue. So it looks as though that's all gonna be a next weekend job. So stay tuned for more information. So I'm gonna have to order some headlights tonight. I'm also gonna order. Might also see if I can find some screws for that bracket that fell out. Um, lots of different things. Another thing I've always wanted to fix up in this car is this right here. So I have like those two nice bright white LEDs and then you come to the front it's kind of like my headlights they are two completely different colors like they're real bad anyway guys I'm going to catch up with all you guys tomorrow morning as that's when we go to techno cars and coffee once again 
So I'm gonna go clean up because I look like I haven't showered or shaved in possibly the last 3,000 months. And um, yeah, I'll see you all tomorrow. At least this still looks good. Oh, get in me, daddy. Rightio, let's turn the beast off before I drain all the battery. And close that. And lock her up, ready for tomorrow. Ah, good morning, guys. It is the next day, and I feel so much better than I did yesterday. However, I did wake up late, so that means we are late to the show already. I'm like half an hour late. I actually read that the show was going to start at 7.30. And I actually start at 7, so I woke up at 6.30 thinking I was going to be right to be there, and I completely didn't get it. So anyway, I'm about to pick up this homeless woman that's... I think I had a jumper, but I didn't, I'm so happy. I was going to say, this is going to be the first car show you've ever been to on time, but we're both late. So anyway, we're going to head down the highway. I have been to a car show before. Yeah, but you've been late. Yeah, the, the I don't fuck with you car. I finally brought Sarah down to come see her dream car. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just filming cars today. I don't feel like talking. Oh, RX-7. Sarah, do you like that? Oh, no. What do you mean you don't like it? I mean, I don't like it. Do you like that one there? Oh. <laughs> come on, please. Sarah, come on. She doesn't like it. Oh yeah, he was here last time. <laughs> Your daddy. <laughs> the best plates ever. This is the next up performance one, yeah? Yeah, that's the 1200. Yeah. 1200. Here you go, Sarah, stand in front of that. I reckon that's your car. Yep, for sure. Oh. Range Rovers, it's just like sad. They don't have nice Range Rovers, so it's sad. I had like shit. Like, I want on my white one. Okay. Sick One over there. No. Uh, You'll love it, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's amazing. New cards in there. <laughs> that's awesome. Even the roof's all glitter. <laughs> what, do you, what was that? Do that again? Come on, mate. <laughs> I like the nude car. Oh the nude car. The nude car. She likes the nude car, guys. No, I don't like the car. I like the colour. What nude car? The nude one. The nude. The like, nude colour. I like the type. It looks ugly. I like the colour. What? Nougat. It's not... <laughs> <laughs> he like the, likes the nude like car. The color, but... She doesn't like the spell marks or she also doesn't like the car in general. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> This is legitimate goals for me. Like, that is beautiful. I see you, I see you. What's that? Ah, oh, it's got its things up. It's doors? doors yeah. There was, you go. I was trying to call you, I'm like, <laughs> get over here. <laughs> I have never seen a Lambo in this color. It's so nice though. When I have a Lambo, it's going to be in that colour. Okay. okay. McLaren 720S, you've got the W1, and the Ferrari California. And then Sarah's favourite, the Range Rover. But with the white, not black. But not with the silver on the doors. <laughs> That's like so similar to Tanner Fox's GDR. It's so cool. I love the colour. Yes. We also have one of the new ZB Techno Commodores here <coughs> that are going to be used in the V8 series. These are very cool. I didn't actually realise but they all have a carbon fibre wing on them as well. So cool. What? New favourite colour. What? <laughs> That is amazing. 
Yeah, I'll, I'll have a type of car too. Can we yeah. get in white? And black? No. <laughs> we get it in that color. That in breeze would look amazing. What if it's like white and then it changes to black? Let's go both. Oh, GDF. Yeah, no, I didn't even see it. And there's a Diablo as well. Nick. These things are wicked. See, then you can start a family yeah, I mean. like I don't know how well you guys can see this on camera, but this color is incredible. <laughs> That's insane. It's so far, it's so cool. Yeah, it is, eh? Different at the motor, yeah. the motor and bonding pedals, and that's it. What is that a 560? No, oh, 570? Cool. No, <laughs> 570. Oh, yeah, it's it's on the or is it a 720? Oh, I guess we'll find out in Let's two just seconds. Go up in multiples oh, of What's that? Let's just go up in multiple. Is it a 1080? <laughs> is it a 1650? I'm not quite sure. Are we having an option? I really got to learn about my McLarens. <laughs> oh, I think I'm late. What is it? Dark meter. Ah, yes. Kicking back because we can. Yeah. Coast. I'm feeling better now. Mm. But just like imagine if this was like your warehouse with like all of your cars. <laughs> Do you have to? <laughs> you see anything? No, <laughs> I can't. That's what I need to write. Anyway, guys, I hope you really enjoyed the video and I'll see you all later.